Hey guys, what is going on? Bobby here, and today we have a very special video for you guys. Now, before we go into it, we're doing another friends list giveaway, but this time we're giving away 10 total friend slots instead of just five. So all you have to do is be subscribed to the channel, like the video, and just drop a comment. It can be literally anything in the world. Just drop that comment, subscribe, like the video, and you are in the giveaway. We're going to be giving away 10 total friend links. So by the next video, so probably tomorrow, I'm going to tell you guys who the winners are at the start of the video. And you can just DM me on Discord or Twitter, whichever is easier for you guys. And you guys can claim your prize. But with that being said, we have the three kb for our video today we're going to show you guys some of his gameplay and then at the end of the video we're going to do a 1v1 against him and before we we go into it i just want to say getting a 3k brawler is extremely hard to get a 3k you have to devote one straight month into doing this and now i'm not saying it's not easier for him because the way he did it was definitely easier in showdown and it being australian servers but the fact that he did it is an incredible milestone tons of work tons of hours he has to put into it it's very hard and if it was easy then other people in australia would have done it but he is the only one and by far the only one to have a 3k so huge shout out to bagels his channel is going to be in the description below i don't want to see any hate in the comments guys please but with that being said let's just hop into the games and let's get started so hopping into our first game here we're going to have some Skull Creek gameplay. Now, Skull Creek, at least from what I know, is known for throwers. Um, I see Anita right now. It looks like he's going to pop that first gadget, and he's going to get a really quick and easy kill. Um, oh, how does he survive this crow? He definitely uses his extra life. Oh, he does it. Okay. But when I say extra life, by the way, I mean that, that B gadget. So don't mock me in the comments. I know it's not called extra life. But anyways, he's going to be chilling pretty hard right now. He's got six power-ups so he's doing unbelievably well um seven right now he's about to have eight it looks like this is going to be kind of a free game for him that m's walked up way too forward he's going to have 11 he's a 3kb he's just going to absolutely dominate these guys he's trying to trigger the mines going to get them both out i really don't know how he didn't get hit by that second one but whatever um it looks like there's only one thrower from what i've seen in a surge which i guess is a good pick on this map since it, since it counters throwers um, but Bagels is doing a great job. He knows he's got that little shield so he can go up and be really aggro because worst case scenario is he just uses the star power he has, which he's not going to have to use for the rest of the game because he has 13 power-ups. But either way, he's clapping. I don't even want to see how much damage his 3k shot does. He's going to use that B gadget. He's going to try and aim it and he's going to get the snipe right there. There is an invisible Leon. Bagels is not having any of that. Doesn't even care that the Leon is shooting at him. He says, I have 14 power-ups. I will one-shot you. Just leave me alone. He sees the Leon, he's going to walk to it, he's going to get that shot off. I don't even know how much damage that did, because the number doesn't appear, but that's a lot of damage. It looks like there's just a bow left, I think. The bow's probably going to give up, that's going to be an easy win. So let's just hop into the next game, it does give up, let's just hop into the next game. And let's keep it going. Alright, so here we go into the next game. So this apparently is an aggro game, so we're going to count up how many kills Bagels gets in this one. He's already gotten one like three seconds into the game, so that's a very good start. Um, but he's just chilling right now in that bush, kind of doing his thing. Uh, he's going to ooh get a snipe off on that crow. Really good shot by Bagels. So that's going to be his second kill of the game. He's going to spot an Edgar. Get another one. He's just shooting randomly and getting kills at this point. So he's got all three kills in the lobby so far. So really good gameplay by Bagels. That's going to be a really poor jump. That's going to be his fourth kill of the game. In solos, that is already pretty good considering there are five people left. That is really strong. There's a Lou just camping in a bush over there on that right side another edgar there's a lot of brawlers specifically edgar that counter b so i don't really know how bagels hit 3k to be honest but we'll just i don't know he did it somehow um you know that's six kills i think no it's five kills at this point my bad did not count properly uh but bagels just chilling you know roaming he definitely does counter shelly and daryl so these two brawlers should be easy kills for him so if i were to predict what's going to happen he's probably going to get one kill on each of these brawlers here real quick and then walk over to the other side of the map kill the Lou, and basically kill everyone that exists on this map besides one person he's gonna get a kill right there gonna get a another one and yeah that Lou is just gonna be a snack for bagels not even worth breakfast lunch or dinner just gonna be a side snack it's gonna be an easy free kill bagels is trying to find out where that Lou is he's just roaming the mid he sees a bush he shoots a bush he's not in that bush he shoots another he finds him and it looks like this is gonna be a kill oh the loose kind of popping off right now, but there's nothing that it could do. It's going to go down. That's going to be eight total kills in this round for Bagels. Okay, so here is his 3K game. So he's doing it in showdown. 
Um, now, the fact that he does it in showdown, again, doesn't really change anything for me. It's still an incredible grind. But he's going to be chilling. He's going to be spraying away. Already four people left. I remember he was at 2,996. So he needed the first place in order to get the 3k in this game. Second wouldn't have done it. So he was going for the first. He's facing a crow, which does kind of counter him a fair amount. Because crow could just jump with shield and just uh, destroy you as a bee. So he's got to stay away from that crow 100%. Um, he's just going to be chilling in the mid right now, taking a pretty aggro position. Still has three gadgets left. I haven't seen this gameplay yet, by the way. So this is kind of just me first time seeing this. So he's going to be going up. He's doing pretty well at this point. Looks like he's getting some red bars. It is not a complete YouTube video if you don't have red bars at some point in between. Uh, but he's chilling. He's doing his thing. He's probably letting the crow and the other brawler juke it out, even though we don't really know where the other brawler is. I guess he's just trying to charge his 3k on the crow that he knows is in the bottom bush. He's trying not to peek and charge crow super, which is a really smart play by him. There's a colt in the top right, so Bagels is probably going to take that out. He's still got three gadgets. He's going to do a little bit of a spin. I guess he wants to 2v1 the crow. I, you know what? I respect it. It is what it is. It's a pretty scary crow over there. Although Bagels is kind of aiming for the Colt, so I guess we'll see what happens. The Colt's trying to get a second place, it looks like. Oh, wait, he is. Never mind. He has 3k shot. Um, so they're chilling. They're 2v1ing the, uh, the Crow. Pretty smart play, I suppose. He's got three gadgets. I don't understand why he's not using one of them right now. I feel like this would be a perfect time to use those gadgets. Come on, Bagels. Pop that gadget. Pop that gadget, Bagels. I guess he's saving them. I don't know what for. There he goes. He pops the gadget. I guess it's really good end game. Not going to get a hit on it. He's going to hit the uh, the Colt, though. Bagels is chilling. He's doing his thing, deciding which one he's going to hit. And he's going to survive, actually, with 100 HP. And that is going to give him his 3,000 B. So that's a really big accomplishment. As you guys know, 3,000 is a ton of trophies for one brawler. So let's move over to the 1v1 game. And let's see what happens in that one. We're going to do it live. So let's hop over and let's see what's up. Okay, so here we go into the 1v1 game against Bagels. Now, obviously, someone is going to have delay. Last time we played, I had delay. Okay, I have it again. I have a pretty good amount of delay. So let's see how this goes. Um, he's on vacation currently, so this is going to be a little bit tough for him. We're both definitely at disadvantages. Um, a lot of whiffing, whiffing probably because of the delay. Gonna try and get shot off. We're using no gadget. Um, insta -be not insta -be load star power. Sorry, the other one. Um, actually, it looks like he has the other one on, maybe. I think a little bit of a miscommunication there. Yeah, he has the other one on. That's fine. We can play with the disadvantage. Hopefully, it doesn't end off too poorly for us. Um, gonna move back here. Pretty even right now. I do have the blue star, but that doesn't really matter since 1v1s go by kills, not stars. He's gonna get a tap on me there. He's still got one more 3k, so I just gotta move back and kind of heal up right now. The delay is kind of toxic. Not going to lie. It's pretty thick, so I would assume he has pretty small delay. Uh, I'm going to try and gain position on him here. If he keeps shooting at me, he's going to be forced into a corner. He's going to hit me there. Hopefully, he takes another shot so he doesn't regen fully. There we go. But I think he did regen. Yeah, he basically did. Don't want to walk into shots. I'm just trying to force him into a corner with my 3k. Going to take my shot there. He's going to be one shot. And there we go. We're going to be able to get the kill. So, one nothing lead for us to start it off. It took a little bit, but we're able to get the kill. Gonna go for that shot there. He's gonna hit me, so good hit by him. He's probably just gonna waste his 3Ks. I'm just gonna heal up so that he is not able to just one-tap me. Again, the delay is really toxic. Um, so it's gonna be a little bit difficult. Moving back. Only gotta stay alive for 20 more seconds, so we're not in a terrible spot here. He's trying to get a little bit more aggro here, but we're just going to try and stay out of his range and keep shooting that same spot so we can't move forward. Going to be able to get a hit there. Going for another one. We're going to try and hit him. This should be a kill. Oh my god, delay is so toxic. But that should end off the game. It is going to, and that is going to be a 2 nothing win for us. So we, we 1v1 before. It was a little bit more one-sided for me, but I had less delay in those. Um, but anyways, GG's to Bagels. Really good player. Really good B. He did tilt his B from 3k. As you guys can see right there, but the 3KB, he's really good. And yeah, that's going to be it. So thank you guys for watching the video. If you guys enjoyed, obviously leave a thumbs up, sub, and comment as it means a ton and it helps out so, so much. That's going to be it for me today. So if you guys enjoyed, again, that's it. I'll catch you guys again tomorrow. Peace.